Hi, my name is Story, and I give my permission to have this video posted online as part of the Gender Stories Project. Hi, my name is Rebecca, and I give permission to have this video posted online as part of the Gender Stories Project. Hi, my name is Tyler, and I give my permission to have this video posted online as part of the Gender Stories Project. Um, for our experience, we are deciding to talk about sex and how we talk to it with our parents versus our friends. And story's gonna go first. <laughs> so basically, I guess I've shared stories with my mom uh, because we're really close. And I don't really don't have a father to talk to about those kinds of things. So she's kind of like my mother and my father in the same time. So there's many stories that I haven't told, her, of course. But um, and those and are for friends because I'm around my friends all the time. I go to college with my friends. I'm an hour and a half drive away from my mom, so I can't really go to her and talk to her about these sort of things. So, in which case, I would talk to my friends. And so I'm very close with them, but I feel like there's nothing I would hide from my mother. Uh, so I guess in that aspect, it's not really different for me to talk to my mom about certain sexual things that I've talked to my friends about. It's kind of a 50-50 thing. But I would more so go to my friends than my mom just because I'm so close to them and I'm around them all the time, so. Okay, so when it comes to my family, I guess I am different than a typical female because of the fact that I talk to my parents about pretty much everything that I've done for the most part. Um, and I prefer actually not to talk to my friends about what I've done. Um, it's just a preference, I guess. Um, it's an image thing as well. I don't want the horrid image of looking bad to my friends, but my parents can know it as being a personal life, I guess. So um, I feel being a woman, I tell them things that most women wouldn't tell their parents or most women wouldn't do sexually and tell their parents. Um, so, yeah, that's, I guess, me. And then, as for me... Uh... I'm, I'm more of the secluded type to where I would rather talk to my friends about a situation sexually than my parents because the open one in my family, our family, is our mom. And seriously, like, sometimes she just like, she's like any other mom who just talks too much. And to where I can't, I don't know, like, I... Personally, I don't feel comfortable talking about it because then she gets into that whole detailed thing. If any of you guys have seen American Pie, it's like the bushy-browed like dad who like gets into it all sexually. Like, well, the sexual anatomy of a person is very important. No, 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 no. I don't want to hear that. And when I talk to my friends, it's more comfortable and I, I don't like – get that uncomfortable feeling from them. I get like, oh, oh, okay, cool, cool. Oh, I've never done that. Or, oh, I've done that before. That's normal or something like that. So I just get a more comfortable feeling when it comes to that. So that's my story. So this is my gender story, and I want to thank our family friend's story and yeah. my brother Tyler for being in it. Thanks. Deuces. <laughs>